don't you wanna go over? Well, where I'm bound. They give the Lord hands up and pray. Don't you wanna go over to that lane? Nothing but joy in that lane. Love in that lane. God is good. Hey, 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 we God is good. I thank God for being God all by himself. I don't know what you come to do. But I came to praise a man named Jesus. I come to show some sign. And be not ashamed. God is good. God is good. We go to the ball games. We, 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 we jump and shout for our team. And uh, we, we go anywhere we want to go. And folks don't be ashamed to show whose side they are. But when it comes to a man named Jesus the Christ, who is on the Lord's side? Feel good, I'm preaching. And I'm ashamed to serve yes, sir. a man named Jesus. Man named Jesus. Yes, sir. Give honor to my Lord and Savior, Jesus the Christ. Uh -huh. It's truly a blessing and an honor to be with you this day. Uh -huh. I recognize my father, Reverend Rice, uh -huh. Reverend Washington, uh -huh. Reverend Johnson, uh -huh. my aunts. Cousin, yeah. members and friends, uh -huh. it's good to be home. Yes, it is. It's good to be home. I thank God for this opportunity to be once again at Prairie Hill Missionary Baptist Church in Columbus, Mississippi. This is my home church. Yes, Lord. The Spirit was dealing with me, and Brother Edmund, Deacon Edmund, was praying his prayer, and the Spirit spoke to me. Deacon Edmund, he was praying, and he said, Lord, help the deacons and the preachers to get along. I heard what he said. That's what he said on the knees right there. He said, Lord, did you hear that preaching? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> he, he said, Lord, bless the deacons uh -huh. and the preachers to get along. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Then he went a little bit farther. Mm -hmm. I would listen to him when he prayed. Yeah. All right, now. Mm, prayer is a powerful thing. Yeah. 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 Then he said, Lord, Oh, bless the members. Uh -huh. He said, Lord, the members don't come to the church house like they used to. I heard what the deacon said. Yes, Lord. And that's going to lead us to our scripture today. Uh, we'll be coming out of Acts chapter 27. Acts chapter 27. Starting in verse 30 and 31. If you be so kind, would you stand? Would you be so kind if you have Acts 27, chapter 27, verses 30 and 31. Uh, Acts chapter 27, verses 30 and 31. Acts, Acts 27, verses 30, 30 and 31. Let's start right there and go to the side. 
And I'll be reading from the King James Version. And the word of God reads as printed. And as the shipmen were about to flee out of the ship, when they had let down the boat into the sea, and colored as though they would have cast anchor out of the foreship, Paul said to the centurion, and to the soldiers, yeah. except these abide in the ship, yeah. ye cannot be saved. All right, yeah. all right, now. Ye yeah. may be saved. Right, yeah. Amen. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, Paul right, said yeah. to the centurion, to the soldier, mm -hmm. except these abide in the ship. Ye cannot be saved. All right. Let's use for a subject today mm -hmm. church in a storm. All right. Come on, right now. Come on, Doctor. I say it, Doctor. Come on, come on. Church uh -huh. in a storm. Yeah. Yeah. Let's use for a thought. Stay with the ship. Uh -huh. yeah. Yes, sir. Amen. Stay yes, sir. with the ship. Yeah. Uh, through my travels, uh, I have seen a lot of churches in a storm. Uh -huh. uh, and we need to be very mindful that we have a spiritual church. Uh -huh. yeah. Come on. And we have a temporal church. All right. All right now. Yeah. We are the yes, church. Sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, as we look at the scripture this day, uh -huh. we must depend upon God as we look at this evolutional time in history. Mm -hmm. yes, Paul is sharing with a decision was made to send him to Rome to appear before Caesar. Uh -huh. All right. Paul was having difficult time with some of the public officials with of the Roman Empire. Yes, sir. Right. Yes, sir. Paul was considered a threat to the Roman Empire. Uh -huh. yeah. uh, so they booked Paul on the ship to Rome. Yeah. Yeah. We see this day. We start our journey in the word of God. Many things had happened earlier in this voyage. Destined to Italy. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, we see it in Acts 27 and 1. Mm -hmm. Paul, along with other prisoners, is put in charge. Uh, Paul, along with other prisoners, is put in charge by the centurion named Julius. Uh -huh. Instead of traveling outward waters yeah. of the sea, they, they, they travel close to the coastline. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, because at that particular time of the year, uh -huh. uh, it was dangerous to do sea traveling. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we see Paul through his life, he was an experienced traveler. Yes, sir. Yeah. And when consulted about this matter of sailing in the late time of fall, mm -hmm. Paul advised against it. Yeah. Uh, Paul had traveled enough by land and by sea yes, to know the dangers of both. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Mm, we talking about a church uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh, in a storm. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, we know traveling at this particular time was not at uh, your best interest. Right, uh, we see uh, the crew was trying to abandon ship. Yeah. Uh, you see, uh, they, they, they act as though they're going to drop anchor. Um, but actually, uh, they were going overboard. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, it's bad to go overboard oh, yeah. in a storm. Uh -huh. It's bad to jump ship yeah. in a storm. Yes, sir. And it's it always bad to jump in the water when you can't swim. Oh, yeah. uh, uh, a church caught in a storm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we see this day. 
Oh, uh, they were leaving a sinking ship. Uh, can you just imagine leaving a sinking ship? Oh, uh, you can see the rats trying to get off the ship. Uh, Paul tell the centurion that only assurance of safety for all that to remain with the ship. Uh, Paul put his trust in God. Uh, what a wonderful thing to put your trust in a man named Jesus. Uh, the angels of God had told Paul that he and the men would be saved. But they could not be saved their way. Uh -huh. Oh, I stopped by the day to tell Pearl Hill. Come on, come on, oh, the word of God says you can be saved, yeah. but you cannot be saved your way. Right. It's God's way. Oh, they must be saved God's way. Oh, yeah. uh, God's way was for them to stay with the ship. Uh -huh. Mm, this was a question of believing that God would save them or not believing, taking matters into their own hands. Yeah, oh, don't you know when we get caught up in a storm? Yeah. Uh, sometimes we want to take matters into our own hands. Yeah. Oh, we just want to jump ship. Yeah. Instead of taking our problem to a man named Jesus Christ. Oh, I stop by to tell somebody that that the, that, that the standard uh, may cross over here. And, and that the lightning may, may cross over there. Oh, that, that ain't the problem. The problem is the wind. Oh, when the wind starts standing up in your life, you're going to need a man named Jesus. We see uh, our life today. Uh, there will be storms. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, Paul's life is a very good example of adversity. Uh -huh. uh, do we know anybody that they have an adversity? Uh, they just don't go right. Uh, your children acting up. Uh, your husband acting up. Uh, your, your, your spouse acting up. Uh, nobody wants to listen to nobody. Oh, I believe somebody caught in a storm. Mm, we, 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 we encounter many struggles against the winds of life uh, that were always against him. Uh, his own people made it difficult for Paul. Uh, his, his own personal handicap were, were always nagging at him. Uh, don't we know any family members always just nagging? Uh, don't you know anybody always just gossiping about something? Uh, they want to keep the wind stirred up in your life. Uh, church caught up in the storm. Oh, Deacon Hammond prayed that prayer. He said, Lord, help me, Deacon. Get along with the preachers. Oh, he said, Lord, where the members at? I heard you when you prayed, Deacon. Oh, God. We work this thing now. We must remember the officials of Rome condemn Paul without a case. Oh, in one way or another, the same thing is true for everyone. There will be long time of fine weather. There will be wonderful days with favorable wind. But the time will come when your weather turns to bad weather, uh, and, and the winds of life will rise against you. Oh, everybody wants good health. Oh, uh, everyone want to want 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 to not have any kind of illness. Uh, everyone want to have a happy family. Uh, but, but not everyone. Uh, won't they? they won't have a good job yes, all the time. Come on, come on. Uh, depression will come. Yeah. Income will reduce. Yeah. 
majority of the people wants to live in a peaceful world. Yeah, yeah. But not everybody will be able to enjoy this happy privilege. Uh -huh. Come on. Uh, why, preacher? Why everybody won't uh, enjoy this happy yeah. privilege? Uh, do you remember another instant back in the gospel? Come on. When the Lord Jesus put his own disciple uh, in a boat. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Come on. Come on. Come on. Uh, one night and sent them across the sea of, uh -huh. of Galilee. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, if you notice something very peculiar, he told them to go to the other side. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, and it is good to go to the other side. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, he told them to go to the other side. And on the way over, a storm arose right, on good. the sea. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, he sent them right into the storm. Uh -huh. uh, we may say, oh, now, don't say that Jesus didn't know that the storm was coming. <laughs> uh, he knew that storm was coming because he is God. So peculiar how God can send you into a storm. Uh -huh. Oh, it is a reason. Yeah. He deliberately sent them into the eye of the storm. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, because he is God. Uh -huh. And he knew about the storm. Yeah. And he knew what he was doing. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we need to remember that we we can be in the storm uh -huh. and still be 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 in the way of never said we will miss the storms uh -huh. of life. That's right. But he promised us that he that we will make it to the harbor. Uh -huh. uh, he will be right there with us through the storm. Uh -huh. Oh, we talking about a church uh -huh. caught up in the storm yeah. this day. Yeah. Oh, prayer hill, are you caught up in the storm uh -huh. this day? Uh -huh. Oh, I'm wondering are the rest of the churches in the community caught up in the storm. Oh, the deacons can't get along uh, with the preachers. The preachers can't get along uh, with, the, with the deacons. The deacons can't get along with the members. The members can't get along with the deacons. And everybody is just raising all kind of hell. Oh, we caught up in the storm. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Mm, the God will be right there yes, with you uh -huh. in the midst of the storm. Yes, <laughs> it's well for one to recognize these things from the very beginning yes. and know from the outside of the church and the inside of the church the wind will often be against us. Yes. Oh, the wind did not prevent Paul and the other men from reaching Rome. Yes. Oh, uh, the storm of life for rangers. Oh, Lord, stand by me. Oh, you got to stay with the ship. If you want to be saved, you got to stay with the ship. Oh, the church today is caught up in the culture uh, with, the, with, the, with, 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 with spirituality. Uh, the church is caught up this day uh, with tradition. Don't you know tradition? Uh, when a 
church is in a storm. Oh, you are, you have some double minded folks. Yeah, yeah. And they are double minded in all their ways. You can't trust a double minded person. Oh, when the church is in a storm. Oh, you got some deceitfulness in the, in the, in the church house. Oh, when you have, oh, when, when, you, when, when you got a church in the storm. Oh, there's some backstabbing going on. Do not desert the ship uh -huh. yeah. yes, sir. at this time. Yeah. He said, uh, except you abide in the ship, uh -huh. you cannot be saved. Yeah. Right, mm, if you yeah. are going to survive yeah. uh -huh. this storm uh -huh, uh, that, that we are in, yeah. we need to stay in the ship yeah. of Jesus the Christ. Uh -huh. So we can can be saved and received unto him. Yeah. Oh, his mercy Amen. and his grace to yes, us. Yeah. Oh, and what I like about being uh -huh. in the ship yeah. of Jesus. Yeah. Uh, you don't have to worry about this ship in shipwreck. <laughs> oh, because as captain of your soul, yeah. oh, he knows how to navigate. You threw the stars of life. Oh, when adversity comes in your life, it's best to have Jesus at the helm of the ship. Because if you try to drive your ship, you're going to bust up against the rocks. But Jesus can navigate you. Uh, he can navigate you through the storm. Mm, he knows how to navigate. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, he can sell me that yes, house. Yes, <laughs> he knows how to give you joy. Yes, oh, in the midst of your sorrow. Yes, oh, somebody today is going through a storm. On, oh, somebody that lost loved ones. On, oh, they going through a storm. Yes. But God will give you peace yes, in the midst of your storm. Yes, Mm, he knows how to provide your needs in the time that you have lack uh -huh. from them. He knows how to help you survive your storms in this life. But you got to stay with the ship. That is the ultimate to stay with the ship. Because the ship of Jesus the Christ there is peace. Yeah. Oh, when you stay with the ship, oh, there's some healing on the ship. Oh, when you stay with the ship, oh, there's some joy on the ship. Oh, when you stay with the ship, there's some blessing on the ship. If you stay with the ship, there's some deliverance on the ship. Oh, if you stay with the ship, there is love on that ship. If you stay with the ship, eternal life on that ship. Yeah. If you stay with the ship, yeah. there's abundant life on that ship. Yeah. If you stay with the ship, there's salvation on that ship. Salvation on that ship. Yes, sir. Church caught up. Minister. You can't do it your way. You got to do it God's way. You can't, you, you can't bump against the preacher. God, the preacher is God's word. Yield to God and build to, to, to weather the storm. The storm of all ages. Mm, it had been tested. Fantastic. But never broken. My Lord and Savior Jesus the Christ. But God will give you peace uh -huh. in the midst of the storm. Yeah, yeah. He'll give you hope yes, in the midst of the storm. Yes, yeah, He'll give you joy yeah. in the midst of the storm. Yeah. Talk about Mary, Mary little baby. Yes, Miles him up to go off the hill. Yeah. And they just had stressed the wild church yeah. and they hung him up yeah. and they speared him yeah. in his side. Yeah. Why did bread yeah. can't sleep it down? Yeah. Somebody that shit up. Wow. Oh.
relationship. The ship is Jesus. Prayer hill in the storm. Come on, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Tell it like it is, preacher. Prayer yes, hill in the storm. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But I stop by to tell somebody. Uh -huh. Come on, it's not it's not your way. Right. It's God's way. Come on, preacher. Come on, preacher. Come on, preacher. Amen. It's not your way. Come on, preacher. Come on. It's God's way. Yes. And I, I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. And when you just keep raising all kind of hell, uh -huh. God will take you out. Take because out. you ain't going to stop what God has to do. Hey. He ain't going to stop what God has to do. He will cripple you. Or he will take you out. Stay with the ship. Yes. 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 I enjoyed that. Yes, sir. 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 Yes